It was good. <clears throat> yeah, we've had a we've had a good week of prep. Um, so today just finished up our second like full game prep day. So it was good. Kind of getting into more of a flow game planning. Um, a little bit different than last week. Kind of transitioning out of camp. So uh, it's been good. It's a little bit new for me. The schedule compared to college is a little different. So still getting used to it. But I got my routine mapped out, and I'll make some changes here and there based on what I like and don't like. But uh, I feel like we're in a good spot. Does the heat bother you at all? <laughs> Uh, I mean, it's everywhere I've lived has been really hot in, you know, Georgia, South Carolina. So I'm kind of used to it, but I don't know if you ever really get used to it. You know, when summer rolls around every year, it's like, man, it gets hotter every year. So, um, but it's been good for us. You know, I know we're going to be in great shape and we're going to be conditioned to it because uh, yesterday we actually got a little bit of a break today. It was a little cooler, but yesterday it was, it was like, felt like it was over 100. So. Um, but we had a great day yesterday, so that's just, it's been cool to see all the guys work and it doesn't really matter the conditions. We've all just gone out there and gone to work. Urban just got done saying that uh, he needs to talk to the guys about, about the starting situation for Monday night. Uh, does it bother you at all in the least that, that this is still considered, quote unquote, an open competition, even though many people don't believe it is? No, it doesn't bother me. I think that's the way to, um, to run a team, honestly. You gotta, you gotta compete for, Everyone's jobs, you know, the best player has to play. You got to compete, and you know, as a first-year player coming in, um, it's kind of what's expected. You want to compete for the job, and um, there's a the right way to do things. I think they've handled it great. Um, we're in a good spot, and we're just going to keep working, and uh, I'm going to take advantage of every every opportunity I get. And that's all I can really do. Do you feel like you're getting enough reps in practice to prepare yourself? Yeah, I think we do a good job of managing it. Um, obviously, as a young guy, you want as many as you can as you can. Um, as you can get just because every look that you get is something new you're seeing and that you can learn from. So for me, I just want as many as I can get. And we're at that point now, we've been practicing for so long. It's more about getting a lot more mental reps too because we can't go out there for three hours every day as the season starts. You know, guys got to take care of their bodies and just got to be careful. But I think we've had great prep up until this point, great camp. And for me, I've learned a lot and I've gotten a lot better, I think, just taking care of the ball, decision making, knowing the offense. But the more reps I can get, obviously, the better. And that's what I, you know, obviously, I'd like that. Do you feel like you've been able to get into a rhythm, even though, you know, you get a couple of plays here and then you're going off and standing on the side talking with coaches and you get a couple more? Yeah, I mean, it's tougher to get in a rhythm that way, but it's just something that it's part of it. Everyone has to deal with it and just got to get, I can get better at that for sure. It's just consistently making plays and taking advantage of every play that I am in there. Um, and that's just something I can do a little bit better job of, but that's part of every, you know, Competition, every just practice in general, you know, with groups rotating in and out, uh, that's something you always got to deal with. What do you t anticipate for like your first road game, the crowd noise, all those kind of different variables that you didn't really have to deal with the week before? Yeah, I, you know, I'm not really sure. Obviously, I've played in some loud stadiums in college. Uh, I've actually played in in New Orleans twice, so I'm pretty familiar with that stadium. Um, it gets really loud in there. It's the dome and. Obviously, Saints fans are, are pretty rowdy, so we're expecting the worst, expecting as loud as it can get, and then we'll adjust from there. It's always better to expect that, and then you get in there, and it's it might not be as loud, and you know it's easy to adjust from that. But when you didn't prepare, it's kind of hard to get ready for the noise. Is that the only place you played inside? You played in Syracuse too, I believe. Syracuse, we played in uh, Dallas, the Cotton Bowl. Shoot, we've played um, in Arizona, which is grass but it's inside so that one was pretty cool but yeah we played a few few inside